Uh, but I want to talk about Rolly Winkler real quick. I've never been a big fan of Rolly Winkler, and I don't know why. I didn't never was. I think this guy is every time he did outside somebody, he couldn't beat them in conditioning. But it took this right here, this lat spread. Look, look at that. It took his lat spread and his bicep, his double bicep, a man. Once I saw those, I realized that he is a lot better than when I originally thought he was. And the reason I never really liked him was because I felt like every time that he came in, he was either too big to compete with these smaller guys who are conditioned as fuck. And the fact is, when he came in conditioned and in very good shape, he did get outsized by like some kind of monster that would step on stage. But it really took this posing routine. I don't know if it was the music or what. But it showed me that Rolly Winkler is a lot better than what I originally thought. And man, his arms and shoulders have always been one of his greatest assets. And you can tell over the years that he's definitely improved. While he doesn't flow as good as some other bodybuilders, he's still in great shape. Though he does have a more blockier waistline. But that's to be expected from a big guy like him. So this is a kind of a video talk. Talking about Rolly Winkler, how I've kind of realized that he's a lot better than I originally thought. And he has a damn good physique, everybody. So that's all for the day. Have a great day. And I hope you all remember to make those games.